Hey everyone, my name is Clara. I am an audacious college student and I am from Central Manchester campus. And today I'd like to talk about 1 Corinthians chapter 13, verse 4 to 7. Uh, love is patient, love is kind, it does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud, it does not dishonour others, it is not self-seeking, it is not easily angered, it keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes and always perseveres. And leading on from that verse later in the chapter, not in the chapter, in the book, it talks about um, do everything in love. And that is chapter 16, verses verse 14 um and as we're focusing on relationships as a church um i feel like these are some key verses to highlight um because every relationship in our life um requires some form of work but i find that relationships that are more distant um it can be easier to you know, think, okay, right, I need to be patient with this person, needs to be kind, needs to be loving towards this person. But when it comes to people we're close to, sometimes we can forget as obviously we're relaxed or at home or like we're just in more relaxed contexts and, you know, um, you can be short tempered accidentally and you're not thinking or you're just not as patient as you would be with someone else, for example. But actually we're just called to do everything in love and show love to everyone um, in every relationship in our life. And I just think this scripture is really beautiful because it is not just a description of love, um, uh, but it's also a list of things that we can do. Um, and it makes us think of our creator who is love in every aspect. Um, and it's also really beautiful because we are made in his image. So we can also be loving like him through the Holy Spirit. So I decided to break this verse into the 15 attributes it lists, which is love is patient, love is kind, love does not envy, love does not boast, love is not proud, love does not dishonor others, love is not self-seeking, love is not easily angered, love keeps no record of wrongs, love does not delight in evil, love rejoices with the truth, love always protects, love always hopes, love always trusts and love always perseveres and I just think the amazing thing about this is that they're actually fruits of the spirit so we can literally just ask the holy spirit to fill us ask for these fruits of his spirit in us and um yeah he can just use us and work through us um and show these attributes and be loving towards everyone in our lives we spend time with people every day, um, whether it's literally just someone at the supermarket, like a cashier, or like our siblings, or a spouse, or a parent. Um, so I think before you continue with your day, ask the Holy Spirit to fill you, ask him to highlight to you what attribute he'd like to work on today, um, ask him to help you emulate um, God's love and be a light to everyone and show love to everyone and yeah i think that's everything i hope you all have a lovely day see you around